What's going on? This is Kevin the Tech Ninja, and today I'm going to talk to you about a quick and easy way to upgrade your MacBook storage without losing data, opening up the laptop, or voiding your warranty. Let's do it. Tech Ninja gonna break the mold, brand state control, scopes more than the case is closed. Real talk with a hell of a red, every word is unfilled, the genuine dread. The tool we are using is called Tardisk. It's a mini SSD that goes into the SD card slot. This isn't like a flash drive, but what it does is extend your current hard drive with no speed loss. I ran a series of speed tests with and without the Tardisk, and nothing has changed as far as speeds. You can opt to use it like a flash drive if you wish but it doesn't extend your current volume, rather it makes a new one. Now, this thing isn't just plug and play, there are instructions on how to do it on their website, but first, make sure you run a backup, then follow the instructions on the Pure Utility or on their website. It takes about five minutes to complete all the way through, not including the backup, and then you're up and running, and your new volume is in gold, and as you can see here, it has the extended space, letting you know that it's successfully paired. Now, when you are paired, you can't just remove the tar disk if you do your system with no longer boot. And to remove the tar disk, you need to unpair it. And that's about an eight step process. And it's not super straightforward, but it's doable while reading the instructions. The tar disk is great if you don't need an SD card slot, but if you need your SD card slot, I do recommend picking up a flash drive. I used the tar disk for about two weeks. I didn't have any issues with it at all. I was able to successfully expand the storage on my system and I had no problems with it. Everything ran great. I had movies on it, I was editing videos and I sort of forgot that it was in there, but I was reminded when I tried to put an SD card in my system. So that part sort of sucked for me, but I was able to use a USB SD card reader and continue working. Regardless guys, this is pretty dope. They have a variety of sizes and it does work with the MacBook and MacBook Pro. So make sure you hit the link down below and check it out. Oh, I'm also giving one away. Pretty cool. So guys, hit the link down below to enter the giveaway and also leave a comment down below on how you'd like to use it. Anyways guys, I'm Kevin the Tech Ninja. Have a great day. And I'll talk to you folks later. Peace. Hey guys, it's Rohan. I'm back. This is a PSA public service announcement. In case you didn't know, the end of Kevin's videos feature an unknown YouTuber, and lately there have been a serious lack of those. So if you're a YouTuber, and unknown, like myself, then send a 30 second clip to Kevin's email, and you might just be in the next video. Anyway, with all this empty space at the end of this video, and because it's my birthday, I'm going to take this time to do a little bit of self-promotion. So recently I made a video called Pokemon Go The Purge. I'm going to play you a short little teaser here, and as a birthday gift, it would be awesome if you guys could all go and check it out on my channel. Peace. Attracting hordes of players. Got a Pokemon? People are glued to their cell phones. 